zero o'clock. Oh, we haven't done a live performance of this. We've only done that animated video. For goosebumps. <laughs> Don't you look in the camera like, like control that. Control those eyebrows. Woo! There. Mm. I was just thinking to myself, I wonder what they're doing with the army bombs if they've put it in any particular colour. The giant yeah. statue, yeah. They've got the train from Spring Day, I think, uh, yeah, and, and then the yeah. shoes on the tree next to it, as well Ooh. as the thingy. Oh, we haven't done this one. Ride from? Uh, Spring Day. Spring Day. Oh, yeah. The flowers and the piano from Yet to Come. Yeah. Mm. School bus is also from Yet. Yeah. Was that lighting rig there before? Hmm. I don't to come down. It might have because they were off stage, haven't they? Hmm. 
So I was like, is that on a screen? Is it on a screen? Unless it's a drone. <laughs> vocals and doubling sounded so nice there yeah. Jimin's voice is a lot more stable he's, he sounds like he's much more confident in it which is lovely it's really, um... whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I think it's best we pause and talk about this now <laughs> someone just cock the <laughs> uh, well I do think that that's whenever... Yungi cocking his microphone yeah he's ready but whenever they okay. have that in concerts like the vocal line will do something while the rap line's yeah. getting ready for their bit Okay. But yeah, we spoke about that before, didn't we? When yeah. I said, um, I feel like Jimin's voice has progressed recently, um, and it's probably all the practice he's been doing for his solo stuff. Yeah. Um, but it's lovely because, again, he's always given a lot of the higher falsetto stuff, which yeah. is, it, it does need more support. Um, yeah. You know, so, yeah. What I find interesting is listening to them do older songs like Save Me. Mm. Um, and I was thinking to myself during it, that maybe Tay's voice has changed the most. Mm. From, if you listen to the early stuff of them singing it then to them singing the same song now. All of their voices would have been 
brighter when they were younger yeah. because as a voice ages, it 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 comes yeah. down a little bit. So that would have yeah, that would yeah. be true for all of them slightly. But and um, obviously experience and absolutely techniques. Yeah, yeah. But I was actually thinking during that I was really enjoying hearing them singing and performing some of the older ones as yeah. now. Yeah, and I know. I've always thought this, but this concert is a really nice... I not I don't mean manly, but they all look so quite mature in their leather and their black outfits yeah. that they've come out in in this. And I've always thought, like, I can't wait to see what you look like as you, like, as you grow, you know, into old... You know, but, like, when we talk about, like, Super Junior, and I'm like, yeah. hot dad vibes, they're older idols, they're fantastic. I really look forward to them, to enjoying them ageing, because I'm yeah. like, you're going to be and so the same, hot as you're older. You mean, you know, as well, it, it's not... Um, in like a, a masculine way they look mature and strong yeah yeah and strong doesn't mean generally like mean healthy. physically strong yeah. it can just mean strong in yourself in your presence yeah definitely and healthy I, yeah. I, I would hope that you know part of this obviously this, this time off and whatnot is the before they go to military or whatnot, but maybe they've had some rest time as well because yeah. they were doing all of those back-to-back PTD yeah. concerts and that so yeah I just think they all look really healthy yeah. today which is nice and it could be, again, from having a break, it could also be from the fact that they're doing something completely different. Because like we said about PTD, they're enjoyable, but yeah. it was repeated. Yeah. So this might also be, they're just refreshed, so they're excited, you know. Yeah. it's Yeah, definitely. And of course, let's not forget that when they did PTD in Seoul, mm. the crowd were allowed to make any noise. Yeah. So now they're back in Korea. Yeah. The crowd can be loud, mm. and it's... Yeah, you know. yeah. I'm happy for them as well, the concert yeah. goers, because I don't think I could have done a concert where you were not allowed to make any noise. Oh no! Like that would have been so hard. So I think I talk in my sleep. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. So vocally, they they sounded beautiful. They all sound lovely. Yeah. Yeah. Really nice and clear and Perfect. strong. Perfect. Yeah, and I mean that's obviously compliment to them, but also it sounds like they've obviously got the the sound correct, all the yeah. the mics and the technician technical stuff, technicians and whatnot. Yeah, they're doing a really good job. So, yeah, very good. And the stage is huge. And all those props on it. Yeah, really good. And like I said, Jimmy's shirt was tucked back in. It was a deliberate act, the untuck. Well, it, <laughs> it may have been through mic drop and then run. It's just like, yeah. where, where's he going to find the time to tuck it back in? And we don't want him to, so that's fine. But yeah, now it's like, oh, okay, slow down. I had Do you know chance what to I tuck think it back in. is that Jimin, he's smart enough that he's gone, yes, we're going to wear the same outfits for each of these songs, but I can style mine differently for each one. Gives a different feeling. Exactly. Yep. He thought this through. He's like, you think this is just a shirt? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Yeah. yeah. You wait for the next bit. It's going to be rolled up and tied up here. <laughs> if only. <laughs> They're all doing something in a car wash. Yeah. Or just be open. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um. So I think the next one's going to be. Oh. Yeah. Can you? Can we just do that a teeny bit back, yeah. just so that we get the cock of the? What's it? Microphone. Is it? Is it the, yeah. <laughs> of, of the trigger and the, yeah, the experience. Mm-hmm. A drink first. We know what's about to happen. Mm. The vocal line did uh, did two zero o'clock and butterfly. Mm. Um, what did you think of that? By the way, that's your first time butterfly. sort of seeing them. Yeah, butterfly. Because oh. I've butterfly done that. Butterfly sounded yet. lovely. Mm. Relaxing. It's really nice. I could fall asleep to that song and have beautiful dreams mm. of riding giant butterflies with BTS. <laughs> <laughs> Although, can people tell us right? Was that butterfly on a screen or was it like something? Yeah, I don't because know. That, it looked, it yeah. could have been a drone. Like, career is so far ahead of technology. It could have been a drone. They've already but bred it was, giant butterflies. It also looked 3D. <laughs> I don't know if it's just on the screen yeah. or if it was just on our screen as an effect, but yeah. the, but not live in, in the concert hall. I don't know. Please let us know. Don't but, gaslight um, us. <laughs> and it was lovely to hear Zero O'Clock Live. Again, they were all alone as well. Yeah, the other one that we saw in the um, online experience concert, the BTS One concert, when they first did Zero O'Clock, they were all in the white shirts and they were all standing, they, the four of them were together. Yeah. yeah, so it was different. It was it was nice. But then like, it looks like maybe it's to do with the staging as to why they were apart. Cause they were yeah, because then it, it was doing something further, yeah, which is that, um, that V roof there. I had goosebumps through the whole of the vocal line stuff. Mm, it was lovely. And I mean to the point that I had them on my scalp. You know when you get them on your scalp? <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm really enjoying to wait to watch back and see your face. <laughs> like, oh. No, I think I think I held it together. Okay, that's fine. I'm not making any promises for like, what's good, to come. Good, goose, <laughs> good goosebumps. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. No, they're all sunny, lovely. Okay. Cool. Imagine you're just patiently waiting, and then this. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> the hasn't snuck in as one of his guys. <laughs> He's so casual with it. He's got glasses! <gasps> I didn't know Kainess. Swaggy. It's hard to be J Ho waiting back there, like just like, come on! <laughs> oh, there's an entrance. <laughs> yeah, K <okay>, Cat. <laughs> oh, you I wish the crowd were closer. I feel like I'd be really vibing off it. Mm. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I love this kind of rocky sound they've gone for with this. Ooh. Oh, shoulders and tongue. <laughs> Sunk about when my man rolls them shoulders. The vocal line did too. Yes! <laughs> I did see some stuff about this song. RM changed some lyrics. Ooh. Which was quite telling or something. Let's do translations, I won't know. <laughs> We'll look it up when we next stop. Mm. 
get a career with a rap hit Take a shot, I need a tool Just pocket more money, got too much hat More trust, you got too hot Trouble stops to hit, make it something that is different. Oh, Oh, what a jack in the box! <laughs> so teasing about this part from Joe Hope. So we haven't done this one. <laughs> Oh yeah. Man doesn't need to breathe. Laram's persona then. I w I'd like to go back actually afterwards and see what it was because I don't recall taking in what they did yeah. with the screens for his bit. I was too focused on him. <laughs> he is angry. Gonna, this is that Ooh. rap is like fuck you I don't care you can't control my shit and then the day after they were like bye we're going to the military yeah. so uh, that may explain what why he's lyrics. so fucking yeah. like why yeah. he's so angry I don't know if they changed that I don't know if that's in the original one I don't know if because uh, I'm oh, sorry there's no subs but it might be because he they were all performing it slightly different the different style because literally all of them changed up their yeah, tone yeah, and yeah, how they course, do it yeah, which is yeah. amazing um, so I don't know. I would be really interested to hear the lyrics, but the um, the the normal chorus of Cipher Part Three, which is my favourite, is like you can't control my shit. So, so yeah. which is good. Uh, but um, which well, I love the messaging of that anyway. But yeah, it'd be really interesting to hear yeah. if they added bits in there. Um, yeah. Obviously, we've not done that one before. No, not yet. And all I can say is RM was angry. Mm. J Hope was almost teasing, mm -hmm. and then Sugar was just swaggy. Like I don't give a fuck. That's a very good description of what it is. Yep. Yeah. RM's is, yeah, his is. I could almost, I, what you I say. mean, like lyrically, I can imagine Jay Hope would say something like, oh, don't you like it? Oh, no. Yeah. Like, it was that kind of <laughs> teasing. Yeah. Whereas angry RM. Oh, wow. hey, he was so angry as well, wasn't he? 
so angry. The, and I was thoroughly enjoying what he was doing. Yeah. But I was also a bit like, can you stop rapping for a moment to show me that angry clenched jaw thing you do? Because... Yeah. Yeah. Vocal lines having two songs, maybe they've chosen. What two do you want? Yeah. So I think the fact that they did... Oh, yeah, because they, they, they haven't actually performed this in front of a live crowd yet. They did it on no, the online yeah. concert. Yeah. But then... They could have picked any of the ciphers and all of them are a flex in yeah. a different way. I but I think they chose this for a reason. I imagine they had a choice. Yeah. And so it's Arg is a bit like... Yeah. I don't well. see if yeah, well, by concept, yeah. See. But Cypher Part 3 is my favourite. This is that J-Hope changed his lyrics. Oh. So the original lyrics for J-Hope go something like, and wherever you go, you find all the losers of hip-hop. Mm-hmm. Um, he changed it to say, and wherever you go, you find those going through their immature days. Oh. Says here, so doing so, he took away the name calling and chose to label the losers as people that just need time to grow. Yeah, that's good, that's good. Oh, part only says about J-Hopes, but yeah. I'm sure someone in the comments will let us know if I'm wrong on that or if there was something that I can't find. Mm. Yeah, let us know if, uh, let us know if you know what the lyrics changed, yeah. if, if any. Um, but what I really liked there is I don't know if I, I couldn't audibly hear where everything was different, but I, as in words-wise, but definitely the the delivery was quite different. And what I love about that is that made that feel very fresh. Like, that's yeah. a, that's, an, that's been around for a few years now, so they've performed that many times. And I like the fact that they were able to make that fresh and, yeah, possibly some added venom underneath yeah. gave it new life, which is wicked. When you've got something to connect it to that's really... That's different from you, before. Because yeah. they wrote that and again it was them talking about from their haters yeah. being like you can hate me all you want because I don't fit into your box of what you think I should be and I've done it my own way so fuck you eat my dust like because I'm over here yeah. like making money and making success and my I suppose own way the, the line I, you can't control my shit is basically you can hate on me it's not going to stop me doing it or make mm. me do something or I'm going to yeah. change it because you don't me. like yeah. it but yeah. you can't yeah. stop me doing what I want to yeah. do exactly I did try and check in on you I was busy yeah. <laughs> I, I said, Are you alright, Cat? Like, I heard a. <laughs> <laughs> no, I wasn't. I was like, yeah. That was my, that's my favourite cipher, and that was that felt like a whole brand new. They did it justice. It was, it was wicked. <laughs> it was so good. 